I'm just going to show you today how to install Minecraft, well, World Edit CUI, which is the client side of World Edit. There's, there's many ways, well, there's a few ways to do it. You can use mod loader or single player commands, but it needs to be enabled on the server itself. But I'm just going to show you how to install it on your Minecraft client. Here's just some pictures, what it will look like, and it's pretty useful, really. I use it pretty much half, most, well, most of the time, yeah. It's pretty useful. Right, I'll show you how to do it. Make sure you have you have the correct version of Minecraft. Now yeah, let me just input my password. Right. Let's go on that force update done then log in. That'd say download and packages. That'll take a little while to download. Minecraft is loaded. So what you want to do, quick game. You you can do it through this way. You can do percent app data percent and that click minecraft.net or dot minecraft sorry. Or you can just do Windows R. Go to bin. If you haven't got 7-zip, or then you've most probably got WinRAR or something like that. If you haven't, I'll do another video on that. But I'm just going to focus on this. You do right-click, open archive. Always delete the meta-inf. Otherwise, it, it it won't it won't well mod loader won't work. So I've downloaded them. So what I do, I right-click. 7-zip open archive it have all the things that you need in there so you just click edit select all and just drag and drop into the app data then you click yes once you've done that just double click minecraft make sure it works yep mine works as you can see I'll just go click quick game again right the next thing you want to do is to install it you will right click 7-zip open archive on the world edit CUI that you downloaded off that website which I'll have a link in the description double click on that then click on classes what you want to do you want to basically edit select all drag and drop into the dot minecraft as you do with all other mods and click yes that should have worked so if I double click on Minecraft, log in, yes it's worked, let's see. Right, I'll show you on the server what it looks like if I go into my servers. Sorry about this. Where is it? Um, I know what it is. Isn't in there, is it? It's up here. Ugh. Go away. Right, it's behind here. It's just my server. I just set up quickly. So that should be loading. Once that's loaded, done. done. Right, multiplayer. Add server. Well, not mine's lo local host. Click done. I join it. Alright. This is just a server I was working on. But if I do, to get the command up to get one down, all you have to do is slash slash wand. And then once you've done it, you first select the block that you want to start off with. And then over here, I'll just quickly do this. Click that, and that will show you your area that you've selected. If you want to make it taller, you just do t slash slash expand up four. Oh, 
Uh, I can't remember. Expand or bring it up? Is that it? Yeah, there you go. This is region expanded 560 blocks up, which is yeah, it's in there. Then basically that's what it is. It's pretty useful. Say if you want to copy something, uh, or I'll quickly do something like say you wanted to copy this area here, for instance. You would have to select it. That is say that you've selected that area, then you can do that expand up for. Well, I'll do it twice, and you can see it has selected the area, and you can copy it and paste it somewhere else really easily because you can see that area that you've selected. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. I hope you've enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, please, because it would be. Much appreciated. Thank you for watching.